Subway riders are already being told to expect extensive residual delays this morning because of the power issue that we saw last night that left riders quite literally in the dark, forced to walk out of subway tunnels for some riders because of this problem that started. It was a fraction of a second power surge that Con Ed says happened at uh, Long Island City that caused problems with the MTA's rail control center. So they are saying this morning for commuters expect delays on the one, two, three lines, the four, five, six lines, the L line. So saying take the letter lines if you can or just take the bus because you are going to have a tough morning commute. So all of this again triggered this outage at the MTA's rail control center in Midtown last night, and that center controls all of the numbered subway lines plus the L lines. The letter lines are controlled locally, so they were not impacted. But the MTA says about five trains were stalled outside of stations, and in at least one case, customers were evacuated from the train to the subway exits. Three of those trains we know were stuck at 149th Street Grand Concourse, 86th and Lex, and 153rd. Street Grand Concourse. One rider last night said he and his wife were stuck on the train for an hour before they even knew what the problem was, and then they had to evacuate in the dark. They made us exit of the rear of the train, and they made, they opened the door on the of the door of the side of the train. We came out and we walking on the side of the tracks, and it was dark. There was nobody there with fresh lights or nothing. I had to use my phone to light up the way for my wife and me. And Governor Hochul tweeted that her administration is doing everything it can to ensure that trains are functioning for the morning commute and they want to get morning commuters more information as quickly as they possibly can. But again, right now, the MTA is saying to expect extensive residual delays on the numbered subway lines, except for the seven and on the L line. Reporting live in Lower Manhattan, I'm Katie Corrado, PIX11 News.